Welcome everyone to another episode of Dino Times. I'm your guys' host, Dakota Morgan, coming to you from Phoenix, Arizona. Today we're going to be covering a little bit of news on this week's new episode of Dino Times. We're going to be talking about the cousin of the Carnotaurus. And that's right, folks, a newly discovered theropod carnivore. I'm excited. Now, this one's name is a mouthful, so hopefully I am pronouncing it right because I've yet to hear it on any other podcast or news things other than reading it. Colokin and Akali. Hopefully it's how you pronounce it. Colokin or Kalikin. Uh, hopefully it's Colokin or Kalakin. Sounds more Norwegian at that point than anyway. I dare comes from us so from late Cretaceous Argentina, actually. And this find is actually important to the species of dinosaurs, by the way, of theropod dinosaurs in that area. We're going to get into just now. So that's a pretty big deal to say the least here, folks. Uh, and that's what we know so far. And there's been some pretty good paleo art of this, of this, of Colloquian. Now, if you guys did enjoy this episode of Dino Times and learning a little bit of Colloquian and the new dinosaur species that you're probably going to be seeing a little bit of in the paleo media, then be sure to subscribe. I should also make it clear, too, uh, there's going to be some pictures in this video that show possible size height. We don't know for sure on this. These are all estimates of the dinosaurs. I feel like we're going to get a little bit more news on this guy later on. Hopefully we find more specimens as well. Because more diversity in paleo science is amazing and teaches us so much in modern history, modern science. Well, modern science and history as well. And so much more, folks. So again, subscribe to the channel for more Dino Times, more paleo content, and nerdy things all around. Leave a like on the video and comment down below things that you've liked recently and it's about paleo and or paleontology you should say, and much more in your dinosaur love and what do you think about this new find thanks everybody and of course as always remember folks science is real